All right, so Greg is trying to put on a fire right now. And actually it seems to be going pretty well. Yeah, because so we have these, look at this. Great job, Greg. Look how this, that? how this quickly takes on fire. Yeah. All right, so our fire is looking pretty sweet. Um, pretty good. Pretty good, yeah. Because we basically just came out here. Um, mm -hmm. In the morning and you can see here that um well basically it's 18.4 degrees celsius which is uh pretty fucking cold so yeah that's the first task of the day um gotta make it a bit warmer somehow we are living truly the mountain lifestyle Um, welcome to this quick little day in the life vlog. Um, Greg and I uh, actually decided to come out here to Slovakia, to the mountains uh, and rented a nice little Airbnb for a few days to work from here and create content. So we are here. Um, yeah, there is a bunch of snow and it's actually super freaking cold here in the living room right now. But um, yeah, so we're gonna be here today, tomorrow, uh, and um, I'm just gonna show you how kind of like a day in the life looks uh, here in the mountains. So hope this is gonna be fun. Uh, the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna kind of like get ready, make myself uh, feel a bit better by brushing my teeth and so on, and then uh, I'm gonna drink a little bit of coffee. So that's the plan for now. By the way, let me introduce to you guys, Greg. That's the plan. To, for those of you who the don't know, man. so Greg, here I am. Thank you for helping Hi, us. For those of you who don't know yet, like give a quick little introduction, like how we met, what you do. I started my agency like two years ago, and I met Vince actually before starting it. And then he was like my first mentor, and now here we are, like two years later. Yeah. So I mean, Greg runs a, a YouTube like content yeah, agency. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Um, and um, yeah, so we'll maybe give some more context on that, but. All right, let's uh, get started with the day. All right, so some of you have been kind of wondering uh, or asking me about my morning routine uh, in the DMs. To be honest, nowadays it's super simple. I basically just like wake up, get dressed, uh, make myself a nice little shot of espresso. Full strength. <laughs> We're going all the way and then I guess start. Yep. All right, so yeah, I, I basically wake up, kind of like get dressed, um, get myself ready for the day, make a little cup of espresso. And then while I'm drinking that espresso, I like to um, quickly like go over my uh, day. Um, so I actually have that, like my daily plan prepared in, uh, in Google Docs, which I actually wrote together uh, yesterday night uh, when I was basically going to sleep. So here's kind of like my daily schedule. I think, um, actually I'm not even late yet, so <laughs> it's gonna be a good day. Um, so yeah, let's get this coffee going. Um, I know it's super unhealthy to drink caffeine first thing in the morning, but hey, I don't really care at this point. Something gotta kill you, you know? So. <laughs> Um, yeah, a nice little cup of coffee from this uh, overly complicated coffee machine and um, yeah, I'm gonna go through the, the quick daily plan. All right, so uh, basically the plan or the main things I want to do today are, uh, well, first we're gonna make some breakfast actually before we get into work, or I'm gonna at least, because I'm trying to bulk up, so I'm gonna put every calorie in where I can. Uh, and then I'm gonna be shooting some shorts for YouTube and uh, Instagram reels. I'm gonna check in with my uh, paid community. I'm gonna shoot after that from 9 to 12 uh, a whole YouTube video. I'm gonna follow up with a client who basically said a verbal yes on a YouTube uh, management like done for you service agreement. So I think we'll get him onboarded um, today. And then uh, I'm gonna also <laughs> I have a lot of like small little tasks today. I'm gonna also 
make a playlist for my YouTube editor uh, to make his life easier and just make him a playlist of songs I like. Um, and then um, basically I'm gonna review one of his edits and uh, upload that video as well today. And then after that we want to do a little bit of like sauna and jacuzzi, uh, grab lunch maybe. And um, after that in the afternoon I just want to like shoot a bunch of b-roll, uh, shoot a couple like quick little uh, videos for my second channel as well. And uh, we want to shoot a podcast together with Greg in the evening. So. That's kind of the plan, uh, pretty much like a content production day. That's also partially why we came out here through mountains. This is like really sick scenery and everything to shoot some uh, videos and photos in and uh, kind of like get all the content done for the next like month and a half, um, at least on the short side of things and photo side of things. So hope you guys are going to find this interesting. I'm going to keep it super real, uh, not try to make it more fun or uh, exciting than it is. Uh, so yeah. Let's get moving. All right, so just for breakfast, uh, it's gonna be super simple. Um, just gonna have some eggs. Uh, we got a ton of eggs yesterday. Gonna have some uh, small amount of blueberries and uh, some bacon, so pretty keto friendly. And uh, also I'm gonna have one of these thick Aldi high protein chocolate favorite drinks, which is probably horrible for my gut, but Gotta get the protein in, and then uh, I'm gonna take my supplements as well. Um, and also, by the way, funny enough, I was just telling you guys that I need to follow up with a client, and as I was kind of uh, getting ready in the morning, I just noticed uh, I got an email at night from him, uh, his name is Brendan, that uh, he's ready to move forward. So I guess uh, today I'm gonna be onboarding him right after this because he's in uh, Sydney, Australia, which is totally different time zone, and so I, I think he's only available in the next three hours. So right after I eat breakfast, I'm gonna get to that and kind of like change up the schedule just a little bit. But uh, yeah, anyway, so I'm gonna cook up like three eggs, a couple of bacons and uh, finish that. And then uh, after that, get right to work. Breakfast is uh, breakfast is looking pretty bustling, if you ask me, <laughs> respectfully. All right, so breakfast is served. I got some eggs, bacon, blueberries, and now while I'm actually eating this, I'm gonna do a little bit of emails, catch up on that, and also send, uh, not send, but I'm gonna review the, the thumbnail and the video my editor made. So what do you guys think? Should, uh, should I keep him? I think uh, he's really doing a really good job. So thank you, Hector, shout out to you. Yeah, so I'm gonna review this, eat this, uh, do some emails, hopefully set up the onboarding call in the next few hours, and then, uh, that's pretty much it. All right, so I just reviewed the video. Uh, the video itself was perfect. Uh, so yeah, I have, I'm very lucky because I have a really good editor at this point who's helping me out because otherwise I couldn't pump out this many videos with everything else I have going on. Uh, the thumbnail needs a little bit of tweaking, so I sent over the changes to him. All right, so I also just got the updated thumbnail uh, from my uh, editor slash thumbnail designer. So basically, just to give you guys a quick tip, the problem with this was that the Premiere Pro logo was in the uh, bottom right corner. And when you are you know, viewing uh, videos and thumbnails on your uh, mobile app or even on YouTube, the timestamp is always here in this corner. So it would cover up a lot of this uh, thing. So instead I made him kind of like switch up the order. So this way the Premiere Pro logo is here and there's nothing here in this right corner. One thing I kind of wanted to show you guys is basically, you know, I don't always go in order with all the stuff that I want to get throughout the day because sometimes things pop up randomly, like, you know, this client uh, writing me first. So one thing I like to do is just whatever I'm finished with, I kind of like cross it out or highlight it with a different color so I can see easily what I have left for the day and also what I have done. All right, so I actually just finished shooting around uh, 12 Instagram reels or YouTube shorts, and uh, now I'm going to shoot some more long form content as well here at this table. Uh, so yeah, that's kind of, you know, a realistic day. It's like not, you know, just driving around in Lambos all day long in the snow, although that would be super fun. But uh, yeah, we are out here working most of the time uh, of this day, but still couldn't be more grateful for this life, to be honest, than like being able to live life on uh, kind of my own terms and uh, yeah. 
All right, hey Brendan, hope you're doing well. So let me show you quickly how you can add us uh, as a manager to your YouTube channel. So you first want to come here to the YouTube studio and then come here to settings. And then here you want to come to permissions and here you can invite me, right? So just put in my email, which is this. Um, and uh, then you want to uh, select manager and then done. And uh, basically then, you know, I will have access to your channel. <laughs> All right, so for lunch, I am just cooking up some uh, steak, as you can see, and uh, we're gonna have some eggs with that, some blueberries, some cheese. Um, so gonna be pretty good light, uh, quote unquote light lunch. Um, I like these kind of like protein heavy foods uh, throughout the day because they don't give you a lot of brain fog, so you can still function. And I usually have like one big carb heavy uh, dinner. So yeah, I'm gonna cook this up right now eat it and then we're gonna get back to work all right so right now i uh first of all just created the invoice for uh this new client who's coming on board uh, so brandon i uh, want to say thank you for you know choosing us uh, looking forward to working with you and also i am checking in with our uh, magnetic creator like private community if you guys uh, aren't aware i currently have basically Two ways I help people uh, with this channel uh, in the paid programs, right? I have magnetic editing, which is for anyone who wants to master Photoshop and Premiere Pro like social media content creation fast. So if you are interested in that, check it out. It's pretty affordable. And I also give monthly feedback calls on that. It's a very, very detailed step-by-step -step training. So you can check that out either in the description or by going to magnetic-creator.com. And I also have a higher level uh, group, Magnetic uh, Creator itself. And uh, you know that is for people who want to monetize their creative skill sets as well. So whether you want to build a personal brand uh, through content creation, right, and sell your products that way, and scale it to multi six figures or you want to uh, start selling your creative services um, to businesses and clients and build a creative agency kind of like what Greg did as well and what I used to do for a long time um, like full-time uh, then that is for you it's uh, application only for now so yeah basically I have those two things uh, magnetic editing for anyone who wants to master content creation and magnetic creator for people who want to make money from it so yeah, if you're interested, check out the description, but enough with the plugs. Um, we are going to do a little bit of a sauna session right now. I'm very much looking forward to it. It's gonna be cool in this weather uh, to get some warm sauna sweats on. So uh, I would say let's get into that. All right, we are just going to the sauna right now. Super fucking cold out here. <laughs> uh, so can't wait to go inside. Um, yeah, let's uh, enter the sauna. Really nice view from the sauna as well. Is Yeah, I think so. Oh, no, it's not. Okay. Wait, I think... Where's the car? Inside. All right, so uh, this is the view from the sauna. Pretty cool, right? All right, Greg, add some fuel to the fire. <laughs> Woo -hoo. This is gonna be great. Whew. We just threw like a bunch of snow on the... Uh, furnace at the end and well look how much steam we have yeah that was really good I think I'm gonna go get a cold shower inside now and then uh, we're gonna get to uh, eat a little bit and then shoot some uh, b-roll and stuff like that for videos all right so we just finished shooting a bunch of pictures and b-rolls uh, hence why I'm also in a different shirt than I was I think in the previous clip uh, but yeah, now we are going to go and uh, buy a couple of things from the store and then going to go to a nice little cute like restaurant uh, nearby. The snowing stopped, but there was so much snow today as well. It's going to be 
well, kind of funny to get the car out of the parking space, but we'll see. So I would say, um, let's get going to the store. Guys, look how much snow we have. This is crazy. And also look at this cute cat. Uh, this is cute. Pretty cute. Uh, but <laughs> yeah, this is going to be kind of a struggle to get out of here. But also look how beautiful this place is. We have like all these mountains, everything. There's life outside of the room where I work. It's crazy. <laughs> Guys, we are fucked. Absolutely uh, covered in snow. Everything looks nice. Look at the villa, but <laughs> yeah, we are definitely not gonna get this uh, done without. I don't even know how we are gonna use the car, bro. Um, that Let seems nice. <laughs> I'm Zabu. <laughs> can only hear the snow. <laughs> Yo, you'll make it! Oh damn, it smells like petrol. So apparently I'm kind of stuck, so Greg is helping out with the shovel on the side. Uh, let's hope we can get out of this garden. Alright, so Greg has been shoveling for like the last half an hour. <laughs> He's a champ. We finally, it seems like we are finally going to be able to get out. So, I hope so. Let's yeah, see. let's see. Just don't stop if, if possible. Yeah. Okay, let's hope there's no one here. Oh. Alright, All right, so luckily we were able to get out of the snow, um, so now we are pretty hungry actually already, so we're gonna go to a restaurant, eat a bit, uh, pick up some, and then, then pick up some uh, stuff from the store, um, and then after that probably just go home, uh, chill for a bit, smoke some cigars, and uh, maybe work a little bit, but yeah, probably that's pretty much it. Alright, cheers bro. Cheers. I think I'll show you what I how are, how are your dumplings? <laughs> okay, look, it should look like this. I'm gonna show you. So, this is what Greg got. Looks really good still, but this is what uh, he expected. I'm not sure. Like, this should look like this. I mean, not exactly, but like similar. But okay, close we'll enough. See. Close enough. All right, so uh, we just got home like, uh, I don't know, half an hour ago or so um, from the snowstorm, which was kind of wild. Happy to be back in safety. <laughs> and uh, we are just shooting the last, you know, video for today, which is going to be kind of like a podcast style for Greg's channel and also probably my second channel. Um, so check that out if you want to see that. And uh, I'm going to link it in the description. And uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I honestly kind of can't wait to... Uh, finish up with work for today. I'm a little bit tired. After this, um, I'm thinking about doing a little bit of extra sauna and then uh, eating a bit and then passing out and getting some sleep. So that's the plan for now. Um, so yeah, we're gonna shoot uh, this video here and this uh, couch. Uh, now we're gonna have some cigars. So uh, yeah, Greg was kind enough to bring some Romeo uh, Julietas or Julietas, I don't know how you say it properly, but yeah, so these are really good. And also look how cool cigar cutters we got. Uh, so this is a uh, Esti Dupont. I'm, I'm sure the French people are uh, laughing, but yeah, I actually borrowed this from my dad. I got this for him as a Christmas present and uh, highly recommend them. Very, very nice stuff. If you go to an airport cigar lounge with this, they are gonna know that, you know, you're a, you're a top G, <laughs> so. Top G cutter. <laughs> All right, so Greg and I are gonna smoke these um, bad boys and uh, probably go to sleep after this pretty long ass <laughs> eventful day. Uh, so hope you guys enjoyed this little day in the life video. If you did, make sure to subscribe and like and check out Greg's channel in the description. See you next time.